What is going on you guys? Welcome back to another live reaction of One Piece. So before we get any further into it, um, let's go into the previous chapter recap. So which I took a few notes and that last chapter is quite basically introducing what what should I mean um, Kaido's team have like what's in Onigashima and what Luffy's team are up against right so a uh, few things Law is underwater obviously that was part of their plan and then there's a big skull and a katana we know that katana is belong to that uh, orc whoever that skull is used to be we don't know who that is when that got slayed that's there is something to it we know you know, it's not just Luffy versus Kaido and the cool design of Mansion with the skull. There is something more to it. It's, it's probably one of the old that probably Ryuma, you know, Zoro's uh, sword previous master. He might be the one who slayed. Who knows? It might be somebody even before, way before that. Or something during Void Century. Something like that. This skull got slayed and then it's basically become a fossil. Remember like a little garden? It's almost like that. And the katana got stuck so deep that nobody can move it and it's also so big. So I'm expecting to see, you know, a flashback and I'm really looking forward to it. And then we have Usopp attack, which I thought I was kind of confused about because there was like a flowers and growing and everything. But I honestly didn't remember. But then I went back, uh, I you know, from the online search, I found out that Usopp made those kids in Pankas at sleep. So it's almost like that, but they didn't have those plants growing on them. So it, he did use it before, but it's just something. It's like an upgraded version, I guess, for Wano. Um, and then, so everybody's in Kaido's army uniform. That's one thing, though. Like, for example, Kid. Kid doesn't know all the samurais. Luffy doesn't know all the samurai. What if he beat up a few of the samurais? So that's that's kind of, kind of a bad plan. Uh, and then... We got Kaido's armies introduced. So we have waiters, pleasures, gifters. Uh, Toby Ropo. There is somebody else I wrote. Which I can't read. Great handwriting. Anyway, Toby Ropo. So we have Ult and Page One. They sound like they are siblings. Uh, at least from what I know. So might be Ult might end up fighting Sanji because page one did hurt Sanji. So you know she seems to be like one of the protective type of sister if she is a sister. Um, so I'm looking forward to it. And then we have Wu's Wu, Woo, um, Black Mark, X Drake, and Sasaki. So we have all of them, and then we eventually gonna get to know. Uh, last chapter was dedicated to these guys. Like mainly the even the title is introducing Toby Ropo. So these guys gonna have an important part of role to play at least and then after Toby Robos we have numbers and then Orochi's forces and we have big mom pirates in the house uh, I actually want to go back and let you let quickly look at who actually is the handwriting messes okay let's see uh, we have gifters after gifters we have headliners sorry I forgot the headliners that's what uh, that's supposed to be anyway Let's go into chapters 979 and family problems. Okay, so they did introduce in the last chapter, uh, Toby Ropo, they were talking about why were they there. I mean, they don't, seems like they want to be there. And somebody mentioned, basically, what else? Hokkaido probably have another family problem. So I'm assuming this is something to do with the son because he didn't show up in the party and he did say, hey, this is a party, bring him out. So, I mean, call him in. So, I'm looking forward to seeing what this family problem is. Uh, let's see. Gang Beige. Oh, my family. Volume 26. The Tontaras find a ship adrift. Okay, what ship is that? Oh, wait. That's ship 20. There's a, another tar ship. Wait, is that Pond? Pound? Because if that's Pound, basically, Lola's and Shivan's father, that will be basically, they will be reuniting there. I thought he got killed by um, Owen, but apparently he didn't. That's why you don't believe when people show like they are dead, but then they got off screen, that means there's something happened. 
Uh, okay, let's see. The Tontada find the ship, blah, 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 blah. Uh, but Tontada ships are, I don't know if it's because we're looking from behind Tontada ship, but it's look pretty big for their size. I mean, all right, uh, let's go. First page. At this moment, Orochi is dangerously complacent. Okay, uh, you can see his cheeks are red and his eyes are rolled up. He don't even know what's front of it. He is drinking. Uh, thanks to the reports from his spy, Kanjiro, he knows everything. That the Akasaya are up to. Okay, you can see a bird actually bought this um, plants to him. And then his plan is perfect. The samurai retribution has been completely headed off. No longer will he torment it by the ghost of the Koseki clan. Remember when uh, Toki made that speech in front of the flame? He actually panicked and even though the hot water was boiling hot, he felt that, I mean, he felt like it was cold. So now he is just, you know, so relieved that his head is somewhere else. Anyway, uh, this is also something about basically say how good Oda's writing is. He basically showing how foolish he is. I mean, the reality and what his imagination is. Anyway, uh, uh, okay, it seems like there are some of Orochi's uh, girls are there, so as Kaido's. Let's see. But the contrary to his belief, the ride on Onigashima begins. Kiyomon's lead, the Eastern Force. Okay, this is going to be interesting. So, Kiyomon on the East, Dan Denjiro leads the Southern Force. Their total manpower exceeds 5,000. Okay, there's a few people missing as well. I mean, when I mean few people, mainly uh, Nekomushi, he's missing. Assuming Marco might show up. But Marco doesn't have to, and also remember, uh, White Beard Pirate Alliance, Okiku's elder brother, Rizzo, Rizzo. Sorry, I'm terrible with names, but anyway, he might show up too. So, looking forward to it. Lowe's pirate submarine proceeds, carrying the Agazaya samurai under the sea. Okay, let's see who's there. Seems like Pen Queen seems pissed off with. Um, okay, for some reason. Uh, what the hell? Everybody's name just disappeared in my head. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Only five of them are there, though. But they're supposed to be seven. I mean, six of them are supposed to be there. I guess Lo is hiding somebody. We have Kawamatsu, Dogstrom, and then we have uh, Ashura Doji, Okiku, and uh, Reizo. See, their, name came, their ne name came back. Anyway, they moved about undetected. So far, it's been undetected. Okay, you can see Lo is going around, and that's his plan, to, you know, to send them from behind. Converging on Kaido's and Orochi. Okay. Kanjiro, okay, we're getting actually Kanjiro and Momo. Let's see, Kanjiro was on his way to the castle with Momonosuke held hostage. But as Kiyomon correctly guessed, he had not yet made his, his way to Orochi's side. I never seen, I've never been in these tunnels. I had no idea it would be so confusing. Okay, so I guess he didn't see the map i mean blueprint of onigashima they did take it you know in advance but apparently they didn't make the use of it interesting from the guard perspective i'm just another one of the enemy samurai i don't have time to deal oh okay he's actually have to defeat few of the uh, guards okay i need to report on what kiyomon is up to but how do i get to lord orochi Okay, there is a knife and Momo is actually staring at it and we've been actually getting focused this much on that panel. So I'm pretty sure he picked it up. I mean, come on. So he got a knife. I'm not sure how that's going to help.
but see, let's see. The enemy still doesn't know that an army of over 5,000 is bearing down upon them. And also since they are wearing, you know, disguise into Kaido's uniform, this is, this is going to be a huge mess, that much I can tell you. It's not going to be easy fight. Uh, let's see. Hmm, everyone left. Don't worry, we will catch up. I saw these things in the battle at Fishman... Wait, I saw these things in the battle at Fishman Island. They are not things, Jimbe. Oh, lol, when he went... I saw these things, I was... I was, you know, from the look of it, you see Onigashima, I was like... How did he know about that demon? I mean, that uh, orc. So, sorry, I'm all ambitious. I, I, I thought we are going to get to see that past now. Anyway, it's the Black Rhino. F-R-U-4. But you can call it Black Rhino. Okay. And the Branchino Tank 5. I am Commander Chopper and I run this tank. I wonder if um, Nami and Usopp is in there. Yay, now we can travel safely. You look so cool, Chopro. I can't believe this was on the sunny, the whole time. You are in good hands, soldiers. Oh, okay. So, um, Chopper's personality just changed as soon as he takes the commander position. Where did Luffy go? Well, knowing him. Dude, Jimbe looks so funny. I swear, he looks so young with that uniform, though. Where did Luffy go? Well, he saw Ustash Kid and his crew run right toward the front door so they have no idea what Kiermon's plan is. Don't worry, I will go and bring them back. Wait, so Jimbei is responsible for to bring them back? Interesting. That's only going to make things worse. Wow, Sanji joined them. It's normally, you know, just Usopp, Chopper and Nami, you know, the weak trio. They are the one who scream, but then, yeah. Alright, but then Roronova said, Luffy only going to make things worse. I will go. <laughs> this this is the worst idea ever. You know, Jimbe going there makes sense because Jimbe have stopped Luffy before. You know, after Ace death and then also, you know, going into Fishman Island to fight Hori. That's also two of the things Jimbe managed to do where barely any of the crew can do to Luffy. He managed to stop Luffy. So now Zoro is like, Luffy going to make things worse. Let me go and stop him. And anyway, he's only going to get lost. This is actually pretty funny that, you know, these two panels is almost the same size and they almost repeated message. Anyway, uh, Jimbe is just, you know, getting used to the crew. Bit more. Anyway, but who cares about these idiots? This is our chance for a little rendezvous on the battlefield, Nami. Oh, okay, he's trying to jump into the tank. Anyway, we are all full. Oh, okay. It seems like Usab, Chopper, and then we have uh, Carrot, Nami, and I forgot her name. The names just disappeared in my head. What the hell? Anyway, get out of there, Usab. Who said you could be in heaven? You are gonna you're gonna aim this cannon better than me. Give it up, man. Okay, uh, so Sanji is having an argument because you can see Usopp is right at the center. Carrot, Nami, and then Shinobu. The name came back. Anyway, want to take a ride? Back seats open. Oh, are you offering? How nice. That's very kind of you. Wait, so Frankie was hoping for Robin to pop in. And if you, if you, if you notice probably... You know, Kiermon's taste has been shown here. Like, Nami, Robin, Carrot, everybody have the bare minimum to cover their privates. So, yeah. Uh, anyway, that's very kind of you. Why is it you? The back seats for chicks. Okay, there is nothing wrong with some good male bonding. Yo, ho, ho, ho. okay. And, yeah, it seems like... Oh, Jimbe and... Okay, wait. Commander Chopper, let's fall out and dock up the rear of the island. Over and out. Wait. Fall out and dock... So they are also going to the side and they're going to meet up at the rear. Is that what they're saying? Hey, Robin. Come up here and sit with me. Okay, so Sanji is actually riding top of uh, the 
Rhino? No, uh, uh, now I need to remember these names. Very great. Okay, and his uh, project, let's call Tank, Tank 5. I mean, I don't, Brachico? Braccio, Tank 5. I don't know what Braccio mean. Anyway, Tank 5. Uh, so, let's see. So soon as Frankie said over and out, you can see Chopper is, you know, filled with joy. I don't think he actually not here. Probably not because of that. He probably is happy because he's a commander at this moment. Anyway. Hey, okay, that's uh, Sanchi. The top of the tank is bound to be, bound to get dusty. Let's just walk. You folks are li lively as ever, but when everyone is worked up, about fighting the key will be having someone who can calm calmly observe the state of the battle wait what's a, what a mature point of view it's good to have you with us okay i want to make myself useful for my first battle on the crew okay there is somebody behind again another slow bet i don't know who that is but i guess jimbe have to fight them first but yeah, okay, so Jimbe and Robin. Robin actually look good. Her, especially her black hair go with that horns. It's, it's look very nice. Anyway, uh, going to the first... I mean, not first, the next page. Hey, all of you. Yeek, it's Master Kaido himself. What an honor. Ever so long time, no see. You know that's not how fancy lady actually talks, right? Oh, okay, so apparently Ult, she is trying to be a fancy lady. Uh, anyway, are you enjoying your drink? I got nothing to gain from drinking with scrubs. I only want to drink with you, Kaido. Okay. Uh, let's see. Sure, sounds good. We will go to the hall later. Today is all about mingling freely. I was planning to introduce you to Lin Lin. But she is still cha wait. Big Mom is still changing. Okay, by the way, Jack is also there. Um, we can do that later. But while we been carrying on, something came up. That's why you are forced to wait. Come on, get it together already. Wait, did she just said, get it together already, to Kaido? Anyway, knock it off. I know, I know. But the thing is, it wasn't me who summoned you here. Huh? Then who asked for us? It was me. Okay, so... One thing, we have Jack, we have Kaido, Toby Ropo. So who is this person, whoever coming? It's, it seems like a black boots and stuff, maybe King? But okay, let's think about it. You can see the see the size comparison in that panel. Basically, uh, what's her name? Sasaki. She's the tallest. Ulti and uh, no Drake is also tall. So is the other. It seems like page one and Ult they are about the same size. And also, if you see the other two, uh, like Wu Wu and stuff, they have this flame like hair, almost like Sanji's dad. Well, Sanji's judge. So. Yeah, wonder. Wonder what's their power is. One of them wearing is almost like a uh, like a flame Kiamon, So I'm looking forward to seeing him in action. Well, I'm actually looking forward to seeing all of them. I'm pretty sure all of them have a devil fruit as well. So it's going to be interesting. So who called these guys? All right, it is King. King, Kaido. I called for them. King, this was your idea. Okay, these guys doesn't seem like. They are actually happy about it. Animal Kingdom Pirates, lead performer, King. That's right. Some of you wouldn't bother to show up if you knew that ahead of time, wouldn't you? Okay, so even King doesn't get respected by Toby Ropo. So, just how strong are Toby Ropo? Anyway, Wu's Sasaki. Wu's Wu. Sasaki. Yeah, you got me. You are formerly captains of your own pirate crews. I know that you are angling for a spot among the lead performers okay so <coughs> is king trying to give them a chance to become commanders 
I mean, commanders of beast pirates, because they are apparently they were all of them are used to be. Uh, we know um, Drake was, you know, part of, a, not part, a captain of a crew. So apparently these guys all were. And I guess I guess he overheard them talking about you know who will move up if Queen dies, because they were talking about it. Uh, I thought they just wanted you know casually chat, but apparently they were serious. Anyway, the organization is a meritocracy. You climb the rank with skills. Okay, so the strong survive. I mean, strong get promoted. All right, uh, that's not what I wanted. All right, sorry about that. Anyway, the organization, blah, 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 we, of course, we are aiming high. Shut up and stay in your place. Hey, knock off. The fighting, this is a celebration. Okay, so, King just got angry. He was, he know these guys were actually trying to go higher. But when they were saying, yeah, we are trying to actually go higher. And he's like, King is like, shut up, stay at your place. Anyway. Speak up, King. Why did you summon them? Alright, it seems like I don't want to get this thing going. I summoned them because I got tipped off about your problem. I thought they might be needed. That's a good point. Bahao, couch, rachite, the day schedule. Yes, sir. Okay, what the hell is that? Master Queen is currently emceeing the show on the golden festival stage but after that the three lead performers and Fuguro Kujo will be holding a toast and then Shogun Orochi and Master Kaido will give a speech okay so whoever this person is I barely can see it there's like a one eye I can see what's happening with the others what is that is that even a thing and that's just popped out from a ceiling I'm pretty sure that's not one of the ninjas Bao Hang, recite the schedule. So this person is whoever this is. It's called Bao Hang. That's the pet name. So we'll get to it. The proper design of him later, I guess. Oh, okay. C, I meant. Okay, C is already there, and C do have like a big fan. Anyway, and upon our, the arrivals of Big Mom pirate ships, we will have Master Kaido and Big Mom join together. To formally announce the world strongest pirate alliance following that master kaido will have a very important announcement that is all okay so there is a very important announcement from uh, kaido and it says upon the arrival of big mom pirate ships so they are waiting for somebody to show up or is this like the big mom children is already there However, there is more ships coming in. So, Katakuri is going to show up again. Looking forward to it. An important announcement. It's not like you to play Koi Master Kaido. It's every, it's ever so knowing. Yeah, I know. But if I lead with that, it will only cause confusion. Okay, so whatever this performance, I mean, whatever this information is going to be really important, it seems. In short, this is the task I want you to perform. I need you to find and bring back my idiot son, Yamato. Yamato? Who disappeared earlier today? Who the hell is Yamato? Yamato, Yamato. I, I can't get that head. I can't get that name in my head. So who is Yamato? That sounds like a formidable task. I take it that you major announcement involves young master Yamato. That's correct. I see. Uh, what is what a pain. It is your stupid family problem. Okay, so Ult have sort of like a like dislike personality with Kaido. So he's just basically spitting out everything in her head straight to her. Okay, anyway, like, hey, and what happens if we bring him back safely? I will give you the right to direct challenge any lead performer of your choosing. How about that? Are you kidding? I'm in. Any complaints? Not at all. Okay, so if they win against a lead performer, it seems like they can become the lead performer. 
So Toby Ropo is just below lead performance. So that makes sense why order like last chapter was given so much importance. Uh, all right. So we still haven't got introduced to Yamato. And there is somebody behind uh, Robin and Jimbe. I, I swear I don't like this one or especially when it's, I mean, just the part where Robin is kept on putting in danger. Remember in Odin Castles he was about to get killed by 10 ninjas and then now here uh, somebody is behind sneaking hopefully an ally which I highly doubt but yeah that's that's the hope. Anyway Fang 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 now scream. Now where did he go stupid Jaggy? Okay he doesn't even know the first thing about Odin's struggle. What if he screws everything up? Oh wow okay so Luffy actually giving some thoughts. Interesting. He doesn't even know the... Okay. Hey, have you seen Yaki? Jackie? Who? Mm. Have I seen you somewhere before? Anyway. Oh, look at all these tasty foods. Okay, have we seen this guy before? But he doesn't... He seems kind of wasted. Anyway. Kwa. Hey, what is this? It's Oshiroko. Okay, somebody just pill Oshiroko on somebody but who's the one who spilled it hey who wants to eat that crap while we are drinking wait who's no they spilled it on luffy okay i was thinking you know since he was wearing the kaido uniform i didn't expect uh, i didn't Think that was Luffy but as actually Luffy got spilled you can clearly see because of the X even the X got actually hit by that you know that belt uh, on him they spilled it on him and like oh Oshiroko they made too much of it in the kitchen so they bought some out here it's sweet you can't have that drink have with the drinks okay uh, Dumb out that sweet red bean soup. It's useless here. Toss it out in front of Okoboro town. Gra ha ha. Okay. He's basically knocking more of them out. And you can see Luffy behind. Good idea. They will be happily suck the dirt dry. You never had that stuff before? Ya ha ha. Those beggars should be happy they are alive at all. Okay. So we know Luffy could actually smash, smash somebody. Anyway. Never. What an extravation food. I, I will never have such a nice birthday again. And I think Luffy gonna, you know, forget the fact about Odin's at this point. He gonna remember what, you know, other peoples are going through at this point. And you can see he is pissed off. Uh, that's not very like a cliffy hangy chapter ending like you no know, we normally have so like most of the chapters we ended with somewhere something gonna go wrong but this chapter is just just there uh, Luffy getting angry but we know he's gonna cause trouble so a lot of things actually happen in this chapter very interesting things one we know where like Frankie is off to one side and then Chopper's team off to another side and Sanji is with the Chopper and Brooke and Frankie is there, so these are pretty. They both are pretty strong. So I'm looking forward to. It. And Jimbe and Robin is at the back. They're taking it slow. Somebody is following. I wonder if that's Yamamoto. I don't know. There is somebody there. And also, speaking of Yamamoto, that's the top. That's the mission. Apparently, King want the Tropi Report to find Yamamoto and whoever bring him back safely get to challenge one of the lead performers. So Jack King or queen they probably will go for jack seeing the ranking but i'm looking forward to it uh i'm not sure how much extra gonna be interested in but if extra can become a lead for more performer that will be like one hell of a spy you know in there uh it kairos team and then what else has happened Oh, okay, and then the schedule is basically Big Mom's ships are coming, so I'm expecting some more members of Big Mom Pirates are showing, gonna show up, and then there's a very important announcement, and that's apparently in, include Yamato. 
I don't know why I keep calling it Yamamoto, but Yamato. That's that speech. I mean, the important announcement from Kaido at the end. It's supposed to be something to do with Yamato. I don't know. Probably marrying a marrying a big uh, one of the big mom pirate. Oh, imagine if if uh, Pudding gonna get married again. Sanji would be pissed off. Anyway, uh, what else? Oh yeah, and then obviously Kanjiro is struggling to get in because he is end of the day also enemy, so they don't know. And Momo have a knife in his hand at this point. At, at least that's what I like to believe. And we know one of them basically Kanjiro, not Kanjiro, Kiyomo and Benjiro. They are taking teams to the both sides, so that's gonna be interesting to see where they're gonna go to. And at this moment. At this moment, you know, Shogun is pretty happy. So that's pretty much it for this chapter. A good chapter, a lot of information. Zoro is lost, by the way. We don't know where he is. Probably fighting Yamamoto. But yeah, uh, Luffy uh, is there, but we don't know where Kid is either. Luffy is actually looking for Kid. And Luffy is pretty confident at this moment, you know, just stormed in. So looking forward to seeing how he's going to get out. All right. And then obviously the challenge and the task for the Tobiropo Animal Kingdom pirate headliner. So that Bao Hank is also a headliner and Flying Squirrel Smile Fruit. Flying Squirrel, since when Squirrel fly? Anyway, that's pretty much it for me for this chapter. Let me know what you guys think about this chapter in the comment section. Well, obviously, I'm gonna take notes and stuff, and then I will throw that at you in the next chapter as a reminder and stuff so i'm looking forward to the next chapter guys let me know what you guys think about this chapter in the comment section hope you guys enjoyed the reaction if you did do give a thumbs up have a wonderful day or night people and see you guys with more videos